Hello guys, this is Lee DVD Collector here and a happy new year's day to everyone and this is going to be a continuation of my DVD and Blu-ray update uh, which I've been recorded yesterday. The first part was uploaded but part two was got a lot of problems um, so so I just had enough I didn't have enough time to upload it in time but this is going to be um, a continuation of that and then I'm going to go straight to the collections for for this for this year so here is the continuation and I hope you all enjoy and next we got Wonder Park packed with childhood imagine imagine and adventure kids cool it and we've got the spine there and we've got the back and this one also has um three guest stars in this version we got Joe Sugg and Casper Lee who are the voices of the two of the beavers and also Doctor Who fans will know that Tom Baker is the voice of the blue bear yeah Tom Baker I he was the one from the classic Doctor Who yeah I think everyone pretty much get it and then we got a bonus features there as well like sing along with June how to draw boomer and the one wonder chips Gus and the what Yodeling Beaver and more. Um, this was around about Oh god, this one does not have any running time. Oh it's eighty five minutes. This one's one hundred and two minutes on the door on the lost city. There we got a disc here. Blu-ray cases. Oh. oh, oh no. Yeah, that's what happens with Blu-ray cases. They never shut properly. Yeah, one the part, good movie as well. And next one, we got Detective Pikachu, starring Ryan Reynolds and Justice Smith. Yeah, Ryan Reynolds is the voice of everyone's favorite cuteness from Pokemon Pikachu. Yeah, let me tell you a story about this. Um, I think back in February or January, I can't remember what this film came out in the month. Um, I was telling my parents I want to see this movie and they absolutely refuse it. So, and when they asked my brother, and if you want, come with me to see this. And he's like, yeah, so we actually did see it. And it was actually a quite good film, actually. And also it came with like a... a a collectible Pokemon card as well with um, Detective Pikachu there. And then we've got a disc here as well. The bonus features are really long, so I'm not going to bother reading them. And this one's run about 104 minutes. And next we've got Aladdin starring Real Smith. This is a 2019 remake. Fall of Fun and Excitement, The Mirror. There we go, the bonus speech is now I'll let you pause and read. This is 127 minutes. Here we go, disc. All these cases are a nightmare. Oh my god. There we go. <laughs> All sorted. And next, for the last of the Blu-rays, is The Secret Life of Pets 2. Now, when I was opening my bottle for my present, I thought it was going to be a 4K, and I was crossing my fingers. It's not. It's a Blu-ray. It's a, actually a Blu-ray 3D. Now, on my Christmas list, I was originally going to get some all of them, some of them on 4K, but I got them on Blu-ray instead, so that's okay. Blu-rays is awesome. And then we got, um, yeah, this, like I said, it's got Blu-ray 3D and the actual Blu-ray included. This one also has two mini-movies inside. Uh, two mini-movies. Um, one hour and 25 minutes. 26 minutes, excuse me. And here is the Blu-ray, and then we got the Blu-ray 3D. Yeah, and... I don't even, 
I don't even buy Blue Eye three Ds that much. I just don't have, and yeah, I don't buy Blue Eye three Ds. I just don't have a Blue Eye three D TV anymore. So yeah, I just got a four K player instead. So yeah, that's my Blu rays, and now I'm gonna show you Ugly Dolls. Yeah, this is not a Blu ray. This is an actual DVD. I just don't understand why they did not actually release on Blu ray, which doesn't make any sense. Because they because the whole entire film was was in stat was in high definition. Yeah, I don't know why it's not released on Blu-ray. Sing along trailers, fun with the cast, making ugly dolls of ugly dolls. And then we got eighty seven minutes. Ugly dolls delivers it in sweet, beautiful way. Deadline.com there we go, it was released by six films. Now, as I always put this skin, strangely, not on the covers, strangely enough, this DVD opens up with Sony Pictures Animation, no sorry, Sony Pictures Home Entertainment logo, which strangely enough is not even on the cover, not, not even mentioned on it as well, which is kind of strange. So yeah, so that's the Ugly Dolls, and next is going to be this. No. Next one, it was a long awaited for any Simpsons fans to come out if, it, if it's existing for another season, and yes, it finally did. Out comes the 19th season. And this is features Homer on the cover. I've seen people did unboxing of these as well. And yeah, since we got the 19th season, I can't wait to get the 20th season on DVD. Yeah. Maybe it's the best idea to take, take off the bottom there. So yeah, it's just like season 18 where it came in like this um, cardboard sleeve like that. Really good. And then also what's really different is, is that instead of have like um, like the note for Mac Raining on the actual um, booklet, you also, it also print it on inside of a slip cover. So yeah. Pretty good indeed, and on the back, it's got like the Simpsons driving in from Springfield. This one's done by like a, a children's um, drawing as well. Um, instead of opening the side like it usually was, you have to open it from the top. And yeah, still do crease marks, but I really hated it. Yeah, you have to get used to it. So there you go, came out of this um, packaging. As you can see, Homer. Marge, Bart, Lisa, Maggie driving in a um, driving. You see like a picture of an American drawn with colors. And then on the back, you got um, the Simpsons are uh, entering Springfield. So I'll show you. So we got the Simpsons here, which is driving up in a squiggly road, and then the Simpsons got eaten by it like a dinosaur. And then we got and yeah, we got Homer Marge screaming. And then we got the nice, awesome picture of the Simpsons there as well. Let's get to focus for a bit. And yeah, the discs are hold in these plastic sleeves. So let me cut the camera and I'm going to take the discs out. There we go. Here is the discs. And yeah, one video, someone complains that... The disc print was a bit smaller, um, something like that. But one main complaint is that when you put on each disc, it doesn't tell what disc it is, which is kind of a bit of annoying actually. But the menus are really good as well. They have still have the same menus and anything. And here we got the episode booklet, which is kept in this pocket here. And as you can see, this is a glossy. Um, booklet, unlike season 18 was in a different paper material. And here we got all the episodes. No screenshots like you usually had. So it's just all mentions of the episodes. And there we 
we go. The season's produced from 2007 to 2008. There we go. Very good stuff. So that is the complete 19th season of The Simpsons. I hopefully they'll do more of this in the future, like the release of season 20. Um, or some people did say that Fox can skip the release of season 20 and go with season 21. Yeah, best not, because because we don't have season 20 in the UK. I mean, the only ones they released in for season 20 is the Region 1 release, and that is it. So, I want to have a proper season 20 release in the UK, just for the completion sake. So, thank you very much. So, yeah, I hope they will keep doing this, and I know Simpsons fans will going to love it. Yeah, before we end this video, um, there are some other DVDs which I nearly forgot to show, which I did not actually put them on to the, um, the rest of them, until I realised it. So we've got some nine DVDs here, as you can see here. So here we've got Nativity, the full film collection. Now, I was originally going to get, I was thinking that I'm going to get Nativity Rocks on its own, but now I've got it in a four pack version so yeah so I imagine I have to get rid of the first first three movies since I got the collection as well so yeah here is the disc of Nativity Rocks and yes just like Ugly Dolls they didn't actually bother release Nativity Rocks on Blu-ray I mean which is kind of pointless because yeah like I said it was filmed in high definition and 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 E1 did not actually bother with the Blu-ray release, so yeah. Yeah, so anyways, Nativity Rocks is a good film as well. If you haven't seen any of the Nativity films, definitely check them out. And then, next one, we've got some two Mrs. Brown DVDs. Here we've got Mrs. Brown, the Bomber Christmas Bundle. Yeah, this is another Christmas pack. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because I have the other two Christmas specials on the box as well, which I might get rid of one day. And then we got got um, discs here. Yep. Yeah, I still kept Christmas treats and Christmas surprises on individually. And there's the new ones, Christmas Conkers. Yep. Yeah, like I said, I still have the other two Christmas specials. I think I like both of them, but I might get rid of them one day. But, you know, I just got this box set. But, you know, yeah, but looking back at these, it's just got really nice artwork on both of them. Yeah, I'll think about it. I might get rid of it, so who knows. And next we've got um, All Round to Mrs. Brown's. This is Series 3. Now, I am the unlucky ones, and I did not have the slip cover. Now, I think this original version, this is original release, did not have the slip cover. Series 1 and 2 did release a slip cover, but Series 3 doesn't. Which is really a shame. There we go, we got disc 1, and then we got disc 2. There we go. So, yeah. All right, Mrs. Brown, it's a good series. It's really good as well. They got all, like, guest stars, like... Um, Noel Edmonds, um, Terry Hatcher, Lorraine Kelly, Paddy McGuinness, and many more. And then we also got like the guy who is from EastEnders. I think it's, I can't remember what actor's name. I think he did, I think the guy he did, Phil Mitchell. I can't remember. Yeah, so, um, Series 3 is really good. I can't wait for Series 4 to 2020. I'll be definitely looking forward to, for, for that. Stay tuned for part 3, which is going to be the final part. And in this, I'm going to be showing you Mona the Vampire DVDs I got. So stick around for that.